Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Dennis, I'm a yoga teacher and in this channel you will find lots of yoga videos to help you with your day and with your life. Enjoy your practice. So this is a 15 minute break time in your office. If you work at an office, you just need your chair to do this. You don't need your mat or you don't need a big space. So just use your chair and you will be fine. Well, if you have the opportunity, you may want to change your clothes and remove your socks and shoes even. However, if you don't have that opportunity, you can be in a button up shirt like me. But I'm sorry, I couldn't really put on trousers because I live in Koh Samui, Thailand and it's really hot in here. So this practice will include many stretches for your spine, neck, shoulders and hips, a total body stretch workout. So enjoy this break in your day. So let's find a comfortable seat on your chair, your hands on your legs, roll your shoulders back for a few times. Make sure your feet are touching the floor. It's good to keep the feet connected to the earth beneath. All right. So you can place the feet a bit wider than the hip distance. If your chair has a back support, you can lay back slightly, but sure, make sure you're not getting too lazy there. And let's close your eyes just for a second to engage to your body. Just see how your body feels in this moment of the day how it's reacting to the surroundings, whatever may be happening in the office. This is the time to get in touch with yourself. Give yourself a smile. Things may be hard at the office, but give yourself this easy time. Take a deep breath into your nose. Exhale from your mouth. <sighs> Take a deep breath in again. Exhale, release it out. <sighs> One more time. Big breath in. Exhale with a sigh. <sighs> release any stress with your exhalation. Okay. So let's bring your hands to touch in front of your chest. Interlace your fingers, make a fist, and start rolling your wrists. If you work a lot on your computer, your fingers and wrists may be tired, so let's just give them some release, change direction. Mm -hmm. Just enjoy those small releases starting Start including your forearms into the movement now. Some wavy movements. Let your elbows be free. And bring the movement to your shoulders. Roll the shoulder back and the other one. Become soft and smooth in your body. And adding some small twists side to side. Just enjoy, start feeling your spine. Now change direction of these waves. Second side may feel awkward, maybe your body is not used to this, but just explore, see how it goes. All right, and gently come back to your center Bring the palms to touch with your inhalation. Lift your palms up, lengthen your arms, open your chest and the armpits. And with your exhalation, release the arms, place the hands on top of your legs. Take a moment there. Okay, now let's grab your forearms with your hands. Keep your arms parallel to the floor and start moving side to side. Start 
feeling the stretches around your shoulders. And start twisting once again, adding some twists into the motion. Maybe even deeper twists now. Feel your lower back and the upper back. And then circles with your forearms. Let the movement get even bigger. Give your shoulders and the armpits the release they need. And change direction. Do it with your breath. Let the breath flow smoothly. All right, and then bring your arms back to center. Just shake them out. Release the tension from your fingertips. Okay. And hands on your thighs once again. Take a moment, roll the shoulders back. Big breath into your nose. Exhale out. Ah, okay. For some neck releases now, let's tilt your head to the right side, drop your right ear to the right shoulder. Place your hand to the top of your head for extra support. Take a few breaths here. Drop the left shoulder down, feel the stretch. Okay, gently use the help of your hand to bring your head back to center. Now gently drop your head to the other side, place your hand, relax the right shoulder down, feel the neck stretch. Be very gentle as you do this, you don't want to create any tension. Be mindful of your limitations, listen to your body, make your way gently there. And gently bring your head back to center, neck long. Okay, interlace the fingers, lift your arms up high, take a big stretch again, and exhale, release the arms. Now working with the lower body a bit, let's separate your feet wide apart, knees face out, maybe on a 45 degree, for some spine rolls now. Let's place your arms in between your legs. This will be very passive and very slow. So take your time into it. First, start dropping your head down, rolling the neck, and start lowering your upper back, rounding all the way down. Hands reach down towards the floor. Maybe they touch. Go as low as possible with your inhalation. Slowly roll up one vertebra at a time. Roll the shoulders back, lift the head lastly. Two more times. Exhale, start dropping your head down. Round the whole spine, roll your way down, folding in between the legs. You may feel the inner thighs at this point. Inhale, slowly roll up vertebra by vertebra. One last time. Exhale, start rounding. Feel the space you're creating around the spine. Take a few breaths here now. Drop your head, maybe shake your head. Make sure your neck is relaxed. Okay, and slowly roll up again. Come back to your seat. Okay. Now, let's cross your legs. Place your right ankle on top of the left thigh. Allow your right knee to release down towards the floor. Keep your toes activated. With your inhale, lift your arms up. Exhale, twist to your right side. You can tuck your arm to your chair, left hand, on the right knee, you can look all the way back. 
Give it a steep twist to your spine, release the lower back, upper back, and the neck. Inhale, turn back to center, lift your arms up high. Now exhale, let's start folding forward towards your legs. Maybe you can put your hands down to the leg. If you have further space to fold down, maybe hands can reach down. They can touch the floor if possible, but it's really not a must. Please do not force anything. Take a few breaths here, finding a nice hip stretch. And inhale, slowly make your way up, rolling up. Use your hands to release the leg. Put the right foot down for the other side. Place the left ankle to the right knee. Toes active. Drop the knee down as much as possible. Inhale, lift the arms up, get tall. Exhale, twist to your left now, right hand to the left knee. Left arm tucked to the chair. Use the support of your chair to twist maybe a bit deeper. Relax both shoulders down away from your ears. Enjoy. Inhale, turn back to center, lift your arms up high. Now exhale, start folding forward. Maybe hands down on your leg. Maybe they reach down. If possible, touch the floor. It's not a goal. Stay wherever you are. Enjoy the hip stretch on the left side. And inhale, slowly roll back up again and place the left foot down to the floor. Just tap your feet down for a few times to relax the legs and release any tension from your toes. And you can add your arms, shake it out as no one is watching. Okay, and release it down. Now let's Stand up and take a big stretch, interlace the fingers over the head, turn your palms up high. You can come high on your toes at this point to add a little bit of balance work here. Keep the whole spine long. Enjoy this big, long opening of the body. And exhale, release. Let the hands meet in front of your chest. Bow your head down, listen to your body for a moment, see how it feels after some movement. Notice your breath. Allow it to flow naturally, smoothly. Invite the prana, the force of life, everywhere in your body. And you can gently sit back on your chair again. Make yourself comfortable. Feet on the floor, long spine, shoulders back, hands on your thighs. And let's join the palms together once again. Drop your head down. Thank yourself for giving this period of time to yourself. And thank you for practicing with me today. Namaste. So I hope you enjoyed this practice. I also teach online private and group classes. If you're interested, please let me know. You can find my information down below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit the like button and leave me a comment. See you next time.